Alright, here we are, back in can town. You use power tools? Alright, let's see what else we can build. Alright, we got several of these, several places. We have a form already. A little fishing spot, that's good. This is some good fishing spot that he brings up. Last I heard they were a small group always on the edge of falling apart. They're doing more fighting than the legends. Okay, but watch your step. La Moral has a bad rep and I don't want Libertas name to be dragged down with him. I'll keep my eyes open. Alright, let's get some new gigs on. Hold on. I ain't logging into it too bad. Still water. She's one right. our next move. Those medical supplies will put a lot of guerrillas back together. Gracias. Lucky appreciates them too. Even if she doesn't show it. And bringing La Morale was smart. This camp needs young blood. Shakes things up. Now we need to work on Lorenzo. Half the abuelos out there hang on his every word. Honron said Lorenzo should visit a BioVira facility. But getting Lorenzo to do anything is like pulling a tank through the mud, sideways. I'm going to give him a little reminder of what we stood for. And you are going to bring the BioVita to him. All you got to do is tiptoe in, take photographs of anything suspicious, and get out. For a so-called research facility, they have way more guns than lab coats down there. They're hiding something, baby Tigre. We're going to slap Lorenzo in the face with whatever it is. Alright, sounds about simple. Hope you have good camera skills. What do you I kids do. say? No filter. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta look for a chopper spot. There's a chopper spot around here. This is a chopper. I'm definitely gonna be have to use my bow a lot. We were freeing Yara. There it is. Our cause was just Danny, Don Ron, Oliver Excuse me, so now I got definitely gotta use my um my bow. Oh, excuse me. There's one thing I don't get about this map, it's like when you're flying over it. Excuse me, it doesn't clear up the area. Like you had literally have to walk and drive through the area to clear it up. It sucks. Attention, unidentified pilot. This airspace is restricted. Land now. Alapina. Where is that thing? Oh, straight ahead of us. Right through. it boom oh that's a chopper okay it shows that we're close towards it where is it anti-aircraft gun I think I see it. it's right over there yep there it is let's take that out before we go to the camp Come in hot! Baby Tigre, while you're at the facility, there's someone I want you to look for. Who? 
Her name's Gabriella. She's a girl from the fishing village. Used to bring us food and supplies. Lorenzo used to tease her for her tattoos and her crazy hair colors. We loved her visits. Until one day she told us she had some good news and said she'd be leaving Yara. That was the last time we saw Gabriella. My neighbor thought he saw her at that Biovira place. Tattoos and colorful hair. I'll keep yeah. an eye out for her. Gracias. <laughs> I'm worried something terrible has happened. <laughs> I'm worried she take out everybody. Got to be careful here. They've got a medic. Get out! Sniper. They're still out there. Be careful. They're not gonna get away. Oh, that metal. All of them. No escape this time. <laughs> That's what you think. Thanks, my bow fool. Alright, so we gotta. Collect the uranium first. Read a couple of papers. Collect this map. Great little stash point. And then we just have a grenade on the house. This one as well. Is something in here? Ah. Let's get over to the plant. Can't believe I had to crash my helicopter. Ooh, thank you for the ride. Shit, those trip short. Don't worry, guys. If you see me cut a couple of the clip and it skips ahead a little bit, it's because I cut it because it's a long drive. So it's not a close drive. Sometimes these drives are far, like a thousand miles. That was 800. Like when it's close to like 200, that's when I bring bring you guys back in. All right, so our job is to sneak in here quietly. No weapon. Engineer spotted. All right, so as we read over for evidence, take a picture. Aim and oh, I want to take the picture. Okay. What is that red smoke? Oh, they're throwing people off. So I gotta get up top and take a picture. Stairways around here. Take out 
this alarm. Where's the other body? Alright, look. Somebody's sleeping on the job. Yep, you can hear them. Somebody's sleeping on the job. There's the officer. Leave another job, fool. There's something under the water. What the fuck is in the lake? Oh! Barcarajo. So many dead bodies in the water. They think I'm going to be sick. Castillo, you fucking monster. I need more pigs. Oh man, that's so messed up. <laughs> That's some maintenance, man. Those look like gauges. But for what? Yeah, Anton is a madman. Spot us right there. These people are sick. Is it what they're doing to all the outcasts? What the fuck are they doing to these poor people? I need more pigs. I didn't want to kill you, but let me no choice. But yeah, they experimented on them with the Vivido. His own people, Jesus. Do not forget the value of truth. On its foundation, we will build Yara. True Yaras must take responsibility for building this future. El protectorado de defensa de la patria. All security is disarmed. That's good. Now you bastards can't call out for security. What is going on here? Controller just vibrated like crazy a minute ago. About to find something nuts, I guarantee you. Sounds king from in there. Surrounding Yara have always been under 
reach, but now they are disgraced by cowards. Cowards who would abandon the country. The president said I gave them everything and for what? Capitalist lies. My fleet preserves this country. No one who abandons Yara is permitted to survive to spread lies. My fleet I need more picks. Yeah, I'm trying to get into this building. Oh. Somebody got the key. Gotta find the captain. What is going on here? this bullshit about treating cancer. What are they doing to these poor people? This should be enough to convince Lorenzo. Al Tigre, I got the pics. You won't believe what they're doing to our people. It's horrific. Oh, I believe it. But it's Lorenzo who needs convincing. And what about Gabriela? I don't know what to tell you. She's gone. Uh, I had a feeling. Okay, get those photos back to camp. It's time for Lorenzo to wake up. Jesus. Time they find that bodies, I'll be gone. That's my car. There it is. Let's see how far he is. Oh, it's back in camp. We can fast travel back there. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Horon was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. This is what Liberta and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yana. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste? That's the bien. You shoot the tree. She's getting real. We need to rally our 
people and talk next steps. Dale. Let's work with that rescue. I heard you kicked Benitez's ass, Danny. Get one out of this shit. I heard it was someone from Libertad that rescued our people. All good over here, I said it. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and skipping school. Woo! Our parents and grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez, Bermudez, Carrillo. The Admiral read their crimes, protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. La Moral taking new members? Depends. What? Is there an age limit? I will bleed for La Moral. If you take me. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> so how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups! Are the first step to victory! The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a convoy I like to make friends with. No. You need Carlito. Push-ups never lie. You just cut your hand open. You sure doing push-ups was such a good idea? What can I say? Your little speech puffed me up. See, si, the part where you put the gun to your head you and pull table? the trigger, that was crazy. I loved it. <laughs> Danny needs to take care of. I like these young areas. They remind me of, well, me, only smaller. And it's going to take a lot more than a basement full of little me's to win this war. The time has come, baby Tigre. We need Carlito. The fifth legendary member of the 67th Revolution, and the toughest motherfucker I ever knew. Soldados would piss their pantalones when they came face to face with him. You know the expression, two birds with one stone? Well, Carlito once shot down two planes with one bullet. He is a national treasure. That was before he retired and went to work in the museum. The regime has put him in a cage to be insulted by filthy true Yaran turistas. His true destiny is on the field of battle. I'll meet you at the museum. Together we will free Carlito from his prison. Castillo has many bullets, but we will have them. I hope he's not gonna betray us like the last one did. Cause he flipped quick. Alright, let's see where this museum is. Alright, it's over here. So we meet over there. So it's gotta hit the road down. I hate when this happens.
Sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, hey, I hope he don't flip like the other one did. Alright, you need to steal a ride or get a ride. Gonna grab a ride. All right, where's my wheels? Whoa, easy, easy with it. Come on, get out, get out, get out. Get out the way. Tigre, I'm at the museum. So am I. If you want to see photographs of us when we were young and dumb, put your gun away and walk in like a tourista. All right, about to take you on that. Wrong. I know the question on your mind. Our revolution begins with the seduction of the weak. Is that Diego? Or kid never had a chance. Come here. Hola. Hey. Just looking around. Just looking around at these stuff. Hola, baby tigre. El tigre, what are you doing? Are you not worried about getting recognized? Don't worry. I brought markers for autographs. One for me, one for you. That's not what I meant. This museum used to be dedicated to us legends. But Castillo rewrote history to make us look like villains. He even found a way to paint Carlito in a bad light. I wonder what history will say about us. They will say, this was the day when two legends walked into a museum and three walked out. Al Tigre! Is Carlito a fucking tank? Of course! What were you expecting? Tell Castillo he's an idiot for me, Guerrilla.
about to say? You sleeping on a job? She's gonna die quietly. Let's get rid of that. There we go. Good boy. Watch my step. Sleep on the job. Got flamethrower? <laughs> Yo, this thing has a flamethrower. Oh, that's him shooting on top of the machine. 
Really? Are you serious? Oh, oh it's past a cave. So you came! What the fuck is he doing here? I wanted him to see Carlito for himself. <laughs> Mi compay. How many years since you've been down the mountains? Too many. Carlito and I, we have a lot of good memories. Time to make some new ones. You should join us, hermano. War is over. When we are all free. <laughs> hey, come. Come on, it's gonna be good. No, I'm good. Come on. War is over when we are all free. Since when did you start quoting Lobo? When I find Ooh, myself past my I love diving that tank. And all that remained was wow. the truth. Shut down three planes, <laughs> destroy Lobo several tanks. We need to talk. It's about Castillo. So, so about so Libertad. It's about everything. Okay, Clara. Sure. No, not like this. Come find me at the Esperanza School for the Lost. I think you know the place. Yeah, you could say that. On my way. Danny, make sure you're alone. No Juan. This is just you and me. 